Hello, this is Bill Wright, reporting to you from 1PM News, your favorite fourth period news station. The first of our breaking news stories comes from a long line of hate crimes breaking out in Texas. On November the 19th, members of the white supremacy group known as the KKK attacked African-American Thomas Akiri, who was supposedly minding his own business. He was declared deceased yesterday evening by officials. Here we have a video of his family mourning his death. Another hate crime has been seen here in Calden, Ontario, November the 20th. Gustavo Juarez was brutally assaulted by a masked man who was reportedly yelling, Death to immigrants. Here we have Gustavo Juarez to uh, do a little interview with us today. So we have Gustavo here with us today to discuss the events of uh, November 20th. So please, uh, uh, tell us a little bit about your experience. Uh, what did it feel like when you were being attacked? Um, well, it was just like any other day. I was walking home from my Mexican band group called Los Tijuanas. Really? And for some reason, these three men with masks on just came and attacked me and knocked me to the ground. And I'm not too sure what I did. I was just walking around here. I have my sombrero somewhere back there. But just walking around and I think one of my maracas fell on the floor. So they fell on the ground. And then these three white men with white masks, they started screaming, death immigrants, and attacked me. So they started clocking me in the head with the maracas. The ambulance showed up and I told them what happened and they fixed me up and I feel really traumatized like I have some kind of disease or something so I'm not too sure what's happening. So do you think these people attacked you? Do you, do you think they were part of some sort of organization? They could have been, they had white masks and were screaming just death to immigrants so maybe. Or do you think this, this isn't just one reign of hate crime? This is a building series of events. Well, I figure if they're screaming death to immigrants, they might not only hate me, they might hate the entire culture. Now, what do you think it is that they hate against your culture? Were they all white themselves? Um, all of them are white, um, and I'm not sure. Us Mexicans, we kind of just walk around and play our banjos and maracas and class, carrot castanets. Well, we're having some technical difficulties. It seems that uh, Gustavo's accent isn't coming through. I don't, I don't know if it's just my ears or... I think my accent's fine. Really well, it's not one. Mexican enough, you know? All right, uh, thank you for your time, though, and uh, here's a commercial break. Need a tip when you're stuck in an awkward situation? Too easy. KFC's Crowd Pleaser. A huge variety of delicious chicken and plenty of tasty sides. Bill right here, just liking to say that I was wrong. You know, I shouldn't have said that about uh, poor uh, Gustavo. He, he did not deserve that. I feel like our culture has become very much segregated towards other cultures. We all have our own differences, but in the end, we're all human. If black kills white and then white kills black, we're, it's just humans killing humans. It's not right. So this is Bill Wright saying, I am Bill Wrong. Good night.
the events of uh, November 20th when he was brutally assaulted. <laughs> <laughs> I'm horrible. Just <laughs> say thanks for your time. It's fine. So, uh. <laughs> <laughs> this is Bill Wright, reporting to you from 1PM News, your favorite fourth period news station. Let me redo that. <laughs> the first of our breaking news stories comes from a long ladder <laughs> who was supposedly minding his own business. He died the other day. Let's redo this. <laughs> Gustavo Juarez to uh, do a little interview with us today. 